EA went ahead and dropped every event information for the next two months. So in today's video, we're gonna go through all of the new events, including that sweet, sweet fantasy event. Now, if you wanna read any of this information for yourselves, the link will be down below in the description, and let's take a look. On the NHL 25 website, EA dropped the season one deep dive blog. So first up, what are NHL seasons? Simply put, it's an always on in-game campaign that includes timed in-game events and rewards that span NHL 25's hut and World of Chell modes. These times, seasonal campaigns will be tied into real-world events. For example, Season 1 is all about the start of the NHL's regular season. A nice little graphic is shared here, and there's a better look at it. The theme for the inaugural season is built different. We all know that hockey is a special sport, its players a unique breed, and the action on ice is second to none. That's the spirit and feeling we want to celebrate. As Season 1 begins, now is the opportunity to establish your footing and kickstart your legacy. So first things first, it's time to focus on building up your team. With that in mind, the Season 1 Hut Progression Path allows you to collect enough XP to unlock 6 new players at different points of the path. The first 5 players you unlock will have an overall level of 80, but some can be upgraded to 85. The Season 1 Hut Progression Path culminates at level 60, where you unlock the 6th new player, Jack Eichel, at 87 overall. Now I've already posted a video going through all the XP rewards, and my thoughts on that XP path, it ain't good. And here we go, in terms of Hut Live Events, here's your schedule for the first season. Event number 1 is Cover Athletes. So week one, MSPs are Brodeur, Makar, Lindros, and Matthews. In week number two, we'll see Stamkos, Ovechkin, Tarasenko, and Peter Forsberg. This event will celebrate and showcase stars who have graced past covers of the EA Sports NHL series. These cover athletes will feature high overalls, perfect for players to add to their hut team at the beginning of the season. Now event number two looks like it's going to be Fantasy Hockey. One of the fan favorite events from every single year, Fantasy Hockey usually brings in NHL players and players from other different leagues and every time they score a goal or win a game as a goalie, go up and overall in NHL 25. So it starts on October 18th and it's an event that features player cards whose overall will grow based on a player's real life performance throughout the regular season. It's going to be an expensive event, so everything here in Cover Athletes. Maybe hold off, maybe don't make any cards, save everything you can. It's going to be hard to get rewards this year, and trying to get the fantasy cards are probably going to be tough. Event number three looks like the Supernatural event. Probably Halloween themed, but let's take a look. Also starting October 18th is the Supernatural event, which is a seasonal event that will run alongside fantasy hockey and will feature players with supernatural abilities. Ooh, spooky! No, it actually says that. It actually says that. Could this mean that we're getting new abilities in the game, or are they just going to wipe out the abilities for those cards, right? The MSP just has a zero for their Superstar Zone ability, who knows? The event after Fantasy Hockey and Supernatural looks like the Off the Charts event. Starting on November 1st, the event puts a spotlight on hockey stars of the past and present who are known for their nicknames. Wayne Gretzky is known as the Great One, Patrick Kane is Showtime, Igor Larionov was the Professor, a lot of different things they could do with this event. And then the final event of Season 1 is the Next Gen event. Starting on November 15th, the rookies of the NHL 2024-2025 season and former Calder Trophy winners will be the focus of this event. For the love of God, give me my MSP Moritz Cider. Now also down here is all about World of Chell. We have the NHL 94 Rewind Live event happening. A couple of new characters in Sudden Death and Agent Blue Line. And of course, logging into Hockey Ultimate Team right now will give you a choice pack, one of three of the 83 overall cover athlete players. I opened up that pack in a previous video. Those players are Marcus Naslin, Trevor Zegris, and Joe Sackick. In my opinion, Joe Sackick, by far the best one. Better yet, let's take a look at them super quickly. So here's the Marcus Naslin that you can get for free right now in NHL 25 Hockey Ultimate Team. He has Silver Snipe. Here's a look at the Joe Sackick. He has Silver Make It Snappy. And a look at the Trevor Zegris with... Silver skilled up. Zegris is a good skater, has a decent shot and amazing hands. Sakic is probably the most well-rounded card. Here's the thing. Sakic has the best skating, the best shot, and not the best hands, but as a center, he can win face-offs. And then Marcus Naslund is all right, but obviously as not a center, he's not as valuable. I would personally go with Joe Sakic. That pack can be found right here in the NHL 25 shop under the Essentials category. And there you have it. The next four events here in NHL 25. Fantasy Hockey and Supernatural are the next events here in NHL, and they start on October 18th, two weeks from today, followed by the Off the Charts event starting on November 1st, and the Next Gen event on November 15th. I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video. Have a wonderful night. I'm going to be saving up everything I can for the Fantasy event and then setting up a trade day. I was going to do a trade day now, but with the Fantasy event coming out in two weeks, I think it's smarter for us to save everything I can 
try and get a fantasy card or two for the trade day, and then do a massive trade day here in NHL 25. Have a great night. I appreciate you watching, and I will be right back here tomorrow with another video on the channel. For now, I'm gone, and I'm going to see if I can enjoy myself in NHL 25. Anyways, y'all, thanks for watching. Stay frosty.